Joy-Con has terrible drift and I always fight it. Maybe I can win then. <laughs> There's so many shells. Hey, red shell. Just got Boomer. <laughs> oh, I'm getting hit with everything. And my wife's not playing this with me because she would be destroying me like that. <laughs> she can't drive a real car, but she can drive the Mario Kart. Look at you, baby nut. Hey guys, it's Jesse and welcome back to The Gaming Corner. Today we are going to interview Coach Nut while playing Mario Kart on his video game experiences. So let's get started. Why do you do this to me, Switch? Let's do Grand Prix because I don't hear. Yeah. You have a preference? Uh, the lowest the better. <laughs> I'm not great. Alright, this is a tribute to my daughter. I'm going to be a... Uh... Be this cat, Lemmy. That's my daughter's that signature go to shy, orange shy guy. There you go. Uh, da, da, da. So, while we make our carts, what was your first game console? Uh, when I was six in 1989, my mom got me the NES, the original Nintendo, and it was pretty awesome. What was the first game you played on it? Um, it came with it came with Mario and Duck Hunt. It came with the gun and it came with a controller. I think it might have came with two controllers, but I can't remember. And then I had the gold Zelda game. Um, I remember I got that. That was my that was my first game that I actually got that wasn't with that didn't come with the system basically. So I guess it was Mario and Duck Hunt, but Zelda was really the first game that I actually got. So then we'll do the Hyrule Circuit. Legend of Zelda this. Alright. Let's do it to it. Maybe I can get a uh, second. <laughs> I haven't played Mario Kart in forever. So this is going to be a throwback for myself. Mainly because this map's from the Wii. Who doesn't love the Wii? I love the Wii. It was fun. What was your favorite game growing up? Uh, my favorite game growing up was probably, um, man, probably like NCAA football was probably my favorite game growing up, like when I was younger, um, just because you could play with your friends. I also liked, um, also like Goldeneye on the 64, we used to always play Goldeneye, like with our buddies, we'd get a bunch of people together and play Goldeneye and uh, have like little tournaments and stuff. We also used to do Tecmo Bowl tournaments on the... Um, on the uh, on the NES, we would have people over. Even even when we were in high, we were in high school. We would we would have people over. And uh, how do I shoot the show? How do I shoot the show? Uh, it's one of the bumpers. I can't remember which one. Oh, the, okay, okay. Right. That one. I got you. Yeah, the L. Um, but yeah, we would have people over. We would play Tecmo Super Bowl. Even when we were in high school, and the game was old. Oh no! Mom. I hit myself with it. <laughs> Um, even when the game was older, we would have people over and play Tecmo Super Bowl, which is kind of like a, kind of like a, it's a football game on the NES, but it's kind of bootleg compared to games now when you really like look at it. Like Madden. Oh, that. yeah. Yeah, it's definitely way more bootleg than those, but it was cool because it was kind of old school. <laughs> kind of nostalgic. <laughs> oh, that's a bullet bill. No. No, no, no. That's not hit me with that. No. Uh, ba -da -ba -da. It's your it preferred console. My preferred console um, was is probably PlayStation. I've never had an Xbox. I've had all the Playstations growing up. Um, but now I, I play a lot on PC because I, I have a I have a pretty decent PC now that can actually play games. But um, yeah. I, I played PC when I was a kid too, but it was like Age of Empires, SimCity, games like that. You know, they weren't like graphic intensive like they are now. But uh, I played COD on PC, and that played. You can play with Xbox on PC now. It's cross platform, which is nice. Um, but I like PlayStation 4. I like some of the exclusives like God of War, Uncharted. I love the Uncharted series. Um, you know, 
So some of those, but I've always had a PlayStation. I, I, I like the controller originally. That was why I didn't have an Xbox. I, uh, I didn't have an Xbox because the first Xbox controllers were huge and I didn't like them. Oh no. Bang shot. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I just, I've always been a fan of PlayStation. I don't, you know, everybody has their personal preferences, but I just never got really into Xbox too much. Now they've changed the controller, so I could probably play with it okay. Keep bouncing off a wall. It's not doing any really good. Oh no, Rich. Oh. There you go. I knew it was coming. If you get in first, you gotta expect the red shell to come and get ah. you. Oh, no. I didn't even know that was the finish either. Yes! <laughs> no. Alright. I say I said second as my goal, so that's, that's when you, <laughs> you put second as your goal, you're gonna get second. Let that be a lesson. Everybody out there. Talking in class a lot, you say you like the Skyrim series. So do you like the RPG games like that? Just yeah. Open world. Yeah, those are those are my favorite. Like especially before I had kids, um, like Skyrim, Oblivion. You know, when I first started teaching, when I was like 22, 23, I would come home and play those games for a while at night, like every night. Um, but yeah, I, I love. I can't wait for the new Elder Scrolls to come out because it's going to take me about five years to beat it having kids and stuff now. I don't have as much time. <laughs> it's going to give me plenty of entertainment for my $60. So, um, But yeah, the one of the newer ones, um, open worlds are great. Like Grand Theft Auto V is awesome. Not student appropriate for everybody out there. All my junior high kids out there playing that game is terrible. But, uh, <laughs> but um, I love The Witcher, you know. That's that's definitely an adult game, or, or a mature game for sure. But um, it's a it was an awesome game, and I did I did play all the expansions on that and beat that. But that was probably the newest RPG that I played. But yeah, as soon as the new Elder Scrolls comes out, I will be buying that game because I just I love those kind of games. And it's what I prefer is the open world, do what you want when you want games. Yeah, and I, I've always liked even when I was a kid, I liked. Being able to customize my character with like a certain race of person, and you know. What was your least time, like terrible timing when it comes to an autosave? Okay, uh, The Witcher, I I thought I was awesome, and I was like level 20 something, and I accepted a monster contract, and you go kill these monsters, you're basically like a bounty hunter for monsters. So you try to go like kill these monsters, and you get gold or whatever. So I was like, oh, I got it, I'll kill this dude. And then, uh, Second again, um, you. I got in. I had to swim through all these tunnels, and it took me like an hour just to figure out the tunnel system. So I figured, swim underwater, which is frustrating in every game usually. And I get to the monster, and they kill me like a million times. And the loading screen takes like five minutes. So every time I die, it's just taking forever. So I put it up, and uh, for like a few months, I went back and played it. And eventually, I just couldn't beat it because I auto saved in the cave with the monster. And I had to turn around and swim out all the way out of those caves. And, uh, yeah, it was very frustrating. But eventually I just left and I never went back. <laughs> I never went back to fight that monster. It was so frustrating. So, yeah. What game do you play when you just want to relax and chill? Um, probably right now, um, probably Diablo 3. Uh, because my wife and I, we can play, you can play couch co-op on that game, which is cool. And my kids like to play it too because it's kind of a, it's not really for kids, but uh, we, um, you can kind of button mash it. You know, our, our, our players are so good. And so when we, when I want to veg out, my wife and I will kind of play Diablo 3 and run some riffs and just hammer some people. It's, it's pretty fun. But that's probably now, or may, maybe you'll. See, that's what I'm, that's what I'm not good at is drifting. I've, I've never really, Played with it that much. I mean, I played with it a little bit. I know how to do it. I'm just not. Oh, here it comes! Here it oh, comes! Oh, it's Come on! Come on! Oh, it's me. Come on! <laughs> Acceleration! Go 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 it's up there a bit. I can still catch up. 
Rift the corner. Grab the items. Throw the banana. Go, 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 Power go, go. through. <laughs> oh. Yes, I caught that slipstream in that last corner. Boom, 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 boom. Sad. Yay. Sad price is right, horn. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, it's been Jesse, and I'll see you on the flip side.